Thank you, Chairperson. Many people in this country know firsthand that Home Affairs is one of the most inefficient departments in government today. It is notorious for its mostly poor and substandard service. On the 25th of November, 2021, Ms. K.E. Mulusiwa, the CEO of Prakis Educational Services, sent an email to the Director General of Home Affairs requesting their assistance with facilitating visa processing for the international delegates that will be attending the International Education Conference scheduled to be held from the 12th to the 17th of September, 2022. Expected guest speakers reportedly included Chief Olusegun Obasanjo, the former president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Ms. Mulusiwa, however, received her an, an acknowledgement on the 4th of February, 2022. Then on the 8th of September, 2022, she received an email stating that all applications of the international delegates who applied for e-visas had been rejected. The Home Affairs Minister should know that this treatment of practice educational services and their international guests was cruel and appalling. They were left with huge debts and were thrown into a crisis because all the conference expenses had been paid in advance and were non-refundable. It is a shame to see how this government is destroying small businesses in this country through inefficiency and dismal service. Home affairs must stop frustrating South Africans who are trying to make a living by destroying their livelihoods and businesses. Thank you.